hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel so in this video i am going to explain you how to implement a chatbot in a python so this video is not for the beginners first of all so if if you are a beginner please go back to my uh, youtube channel and please watch the basics of the python so you will be able to understand this program so in this video what we will be needing we will be needing these three libraries in a python that is chatbot chatbot corpus and then spacey and we have a requirement of a python should be installed into our windows system and we should be we will be installing the pip into our windows system so i have already created how to install a python into our windows system so you can go and watch my videos and uh, let's see how we can implement the uh, chatbot into our python system hello guys so let's start the implementation of the chatbot in a python so i'm going to go step by step here i will share this document with you in the description so first of all we have to install a pip into our windows system so what is the command for that we need to download this get uh, get pip.py from one of the link that i have mentioned in the description and then we have to type a command python get pip.py so this is how we can install a uh, pip into our windows system so let's start how we can do that so i have already uh, i already uh, installed the git uh, i have already installed uh, sorry i have already downloaded the git pip.py here so how we can do that uh, installing the pip if we open pmd here first of all check echo here uh, like python path python oh my actually sorry so if we check here so it is showing the correct uh, result so <coughs> So we have to go for this Python, then get pip.py. So it will install the pip into our system. So by that, uh, we can use the pip uh, installer to install the models in the Python. So let's start this. The so Python is not a recognizer. And why it is doing? Because if we see echo and uh, path case, so somewhere it is. Uh, not showing okay no problem if we can on this command line by using command prompt like as an administrator and if we go into now if we do this I think it should get yeah it is running right now so what it will do, it will go to the uh, repository and it will fill the pip uh, and our uh, setup tools and build package and it will be installed into our Python installation folder. So yeah, it is successfully installed, but if we do like this, it is giving an error. So how to resolve this error? So I am going to tell you like this error is causing lots of developer to, uh, lots of developer. Uh, so for resolving this here, we you have to go here and there will Python maybe it is a version and dot uh, underscore pth file. So go into this file, edit here, and here you have to, what you have to do like you have to go here. Uh, you have to go into script. You have to pick up the path, and then you have to just paste it here. Also, you have to take two paths. I think. Let's try this big path also and one more. If we go into the side packages, take this path and paste it here. So it will Python will get to know where the lib packages is and where the side packages is also and also the scripts are trip locations. So after that, what we will do, we will close this command line action. And again, we will look at this command line by using administrator. Uh, uh, guys, uh, this is very important actually. You have to open the command line every time in administrator mode. So we will not get any stuff in middle of the installation of any module or any, anything. So this is a very good habit for what I can tell. So let's go to our Python folder. I am in here in Python folder. If I hit here, so it is showing me the pip is installed into 
this location okay so uh, right now what we have to do here like uh, we will be installing uh, uh, we have already installed the pip so we will be following the second step so this is the second step in the second step we have to install the chatbot and chatbot corpus so let's see how we can do that For installing the chatterbot and chatterbot corpus, you have to go into the command line of okay? and here you have to just type by pip install chatterbot and then uh, enter. So it will install the chatterbot into your Python uh, installation folder and into your system actually. So it is installing this six package Python data details package, SQL uh, alchemy package, uh, quit set package, then math, math parse package and chatterbot package. So let's wait for its installation. So yeah, this uh, package has been installed into our system successfully. So again, you have to type another command. I click install chatterbot underscore corpus, and you have to press enter. So it will install the another model here. Uh, yeah, it is. Problem. We'll again install it and we'll see. Already satisfied. Okay, so it is already installed here. So, what you, we can uh, do right now, so let's uh, implement the chatbot. Before implementation of the chatbot uh, program, uh, we have to do these steps also. So, just copy and maybe not. I can directly type page dot corpus. Yeah, I have yeah, it is saying it is already up to date. Then again for chatterbot also, this library also we have to do the update. Okay, so it is already a requirement already satisfied. So no need to upgrade. Okay, so right now uh, we have installed both uh, these packages, Chatterbot and Chatterbot Corpus. Uh, these are the really two important packages that we have to install into our Windows system. So right now, what is the uh, third step? Is write a program to Chatbot. So let's uh, implement the Chatbot program for implementation of the Chatbot. We have to open a PyCharm here. So I have created a Python practice for a project here and there is one main.py file here. So in this file I am going to write like from, from chatterbot import chatterbot and another library I am going to add is from chatterbot uh, trainer chatterbot dot trainers import we have to import here is chatterbot corpus trainer so this is the two libraries that is very important you have to include into your program after that you have to create one bot so i am creating my bot is equal to chatbot in this chatbot i am going to pass the name is equal to maybe uh, yes bot and then uh, there is one other parameter you have to pass it here so true and here you have to pass the logical adapter which will be used to match the string to with the training data so here i am passing like here you have to pass chatterbot dot logic dot mathematical evaluation And another one is you have to pass it here like chatterbot dot logic dot paste match. So these are the two uh, logical adapter you have to pass it to the uh, as a parameter. After this bot is uh, has been created, so after the bot we have to do we have to train the trainer whatever trainer we are going to use. Like here we are using corpus. Uh, corpus trainer so uh, how to train that trainer so first of all what we have to do we have to tell the trainer which bot you are going to use so i'm going to create a trainer here then in this corpus trainer we have to pass it, pass to my bot so this bot we are using and what data we are using so how we can do that corpus trainer dot train 
so this is this is the train method by which uh, you are passing the data you are telling the python compiler that which data you want to use so i am passing your chat about dot so it will tell that uh, we are using the english language and we are using english language data which is already available so let's save this program and uh, i will add it for the input and output with the uh, like input and output with the chatbot so i will add a while loop with a true sign okay uh, sorry double capital <coughs> so here i am taking the input from the user like here uh, input and i am passing this input to the uh, my bot so what is the bot result here like my bot dot get response so whatever the user will say to the bot and bot will get uh, get the response from the uh, training data and it pass it to us so this loop will get uh, executed infinity times and uh, until and unless we uh, user close this program the chatting will happen between bot and user so let's run this program and we will see what is the result okay so it is saying that we don't have the model name spacey so we have to install the spacey let's do that uh, sorry pip install spacey okay and then you have to just press enter so it will install a spacey so let's wait wait for installation Okay, so it is installed. As you can see, all the law, uh, all the libraries has been installed into our Python installation folder. So this is how you can install a spacey. So let's run this program again. So we will see what is happening here. Yeah, so it is saying it is throwing an error for can't find a model en. So it is not getting the model en. That is, it is not uh, finding the data for the English language. So how to do that? I actually I have already uh, given the steps here. So you can go here. You can use this command Python minus n space you know, download here, yes. and you have to just paste it here, and you have to uh, press enter. So what it will do? It will download the en uh, uh, English language data and into uh, into the Python installation folder. So just press enter and wait for its installation. So it is downloading uh, from the github.com so let's wait for its installation okay so this uh, en model has successfully installed and it is uh, showing the message you can now load the model via spacey.load yeah so now let's run this program again Wait. Okay. So now it is uh, uh, training the each and every data file uh, which has in uh, Python installation folder. I'm going to show you where these data files are actually. So it is loading all the ai.yml, bot.profile.yml, emotion.yml, food.yml. So all the file it is loading. So we we'll just wait, wait for its process. Okay. So here I am going to say hi. So what is giving answer? How are you doing? So I will say drink. Okay, so it is showing me the answer like my brain does not require the images. So I will say oh really? Trading is an volume. So uh, it is giving me another answer because he doesn't know what to uh, what to give the answer. So this is uh, uh, this is how we can implement the chatbot in a python and we have to give a proper data or we have to create a lots of uh, proper data uh, for training data then and then only our bot will get uh, that much efficiency with the users okay so uh, thank you guys for watching this video and uh, i think uh, you like this video uh, if you like this video, please like, share and comment on my videos and um, 
in the next video i am going to explain you like how to use a uh, customized data for this uh, my bot uh, for this chatbot in a python so uh, we will be uh, we will be uh, discussing how we can create a data and then how we can train our trainer with that data so uh, until the uh, until the next video uh, you can uh, practice this uh, this program and let me know your uh, feedback into the comment thank you guys for watching this video please like share and subscribe to my youtube channel